Hi, I'm Brian Johnson, Fairchild Semiconductor Lighting Specialist. If you're designing a driver for small LED lamps, such as the MR11 or MR16, then you're facing challenges such as a lack of standards on lamp fixture and bulb shape, power factor, total harmonic distortion, and low power efficiency often associated with such designs. This short video introduces you to the FL7701, a non-isolated PFC buck LED driver that is an ideal solution for AC to DC MR type lamp designs. Watch Alex Craig, Fairchild Principal Applications Engineer, demonstrate the unique features of the FL7701. I'm Alex Craig, Fairchild Semiconductor. I'm a uh, Principal Application Engineer. This is the Fairchild's 7701 High Power Factor LED Buck Driver. It is part of Fairchild's dedicated LED lighting products designed for, to meet all the requirements, high power factor and efficiency requirements needed, and simplicity of design at low bomb cost. What we have is our AC line voltage coming in. This is our AC current. You see they're in phase, it's extra sinusoidal. It has a power factor of about 0.95. The LED current right now is showing 100% ripple current, but we're, we control the LED current through this device as a constant current regulation. This chip measures, notices that it has an AC line input and says, oh, I'm in an AC circuit. Since I'm in an AC circuit, I want to control my LED current. So, so the input current is also sinusoidal and AC and has good power factor. If the circuit was in a DC circuit, it would say, hey, I don't see an AC, a zero crossing of my AC signal and say, oh, I'm in a DC circuit and would control the LED current at the peak value. This chip has the ability for analog dimming input. So this represents the LED voltage, the voltage across the load. And as I drop it, you'll see the current will drop as my intensity also drops, and you'll see the LED voltage also drops. This chip has some basic fundamental uh, protections, such as open load. So when I push the open load button, my voltage across the LEDs, which are now open, will be line voltage rectified. So I'll go from 11 volts to 160 or so volts DC. And of course, short, shorted load voltage, should someone screw, have a problem when they assembled the system and shorted the leads together, that would have, if I short the loads, it will go to zero volts, basically, across the load and I still breathe protection features. This is designed for a very inexpensive LED drive solution for a total bill of materials of 15 parts. If you do not want to have the 100% ripple current, you can add one more part, which is a capacitor across the LED voltage. That will smooth that out to give you the ripple current designed, and it allows for still maintaining high power factor. Applications for inexpensive light bulbs like this, for non-dimming design, you can do this without or for dimming design where you have an analog input, such as a T8 lamp or a fluorescent light bulb replacement system, um, where you would have a dolly interface or a ZB or an RF interface, so would, you would send it a signal saying, I want the lights to go down intensity. Any sort of LED driver solution. Um, it's a buck design, so the key, the key parameters are your load voltage it only delivers power when the, when the load voltage is much less than the line voltage, which is great for non-isolated designs. I typically have industrial lamps of 277 VAC, and I typically have load voltages on the order of, you know, 30 or 40 volts. The benefits of this is a very inexpensive, constant current, high power factor corrected LED drive solution. So for any, for any design that is really cost sensitive and you need a really low total bill of materials cost, 15 parts in total. Very simple. Thanks, Alex. As you can see here, the topology of the FL7701 offers a number of design advantages for MR-type lamp designs that solve performance, cost, and size trade-offs. We invite you to access any of our FL7701 design resources at FairchildSemi.com, and there you can also explore our innovative topologies for other low-power LED driver designs. Thank you.